it's just a parent here at Parent Power Sports, and today we're going to be looking at how to rotate the torque converter on your Predator 212 engine or other small go kart engines. So, if you haven't already uninstalled your torque converter, you're just going to take your flathead screwdriver and slip it into the slot here, and then you're going to take your wrench and loosen the bolt. After you've loosened that bolt, you're just gonna pull all your parts off the shaft. Then you're gonna take your wrench and loosen the four bolts holding the torque converter to the engine. The next step is going to be to remove your pulley. And you're going to do that by taking a flathead screwdriver and sliding it into your pulley. Then you're going to take a crescent wrench and loosen the bolt. So now that you've removed the bolt from your pulley, you're going to slide the pulley off the shaft. Then you're going to slide your sprocket off, your keyed washer, and then your key. So now what you're going to need to do is uninstall the shaft. So now what you're going to need to do is grind these slits off your torque converter. The reason you need to do this is because your sprocket's going to sit right here and your chain is going to hit these pieces. onto your torque converter. So we're gonna slide our shaft back on. Then we're gonna get our keyed washer, slide that onto the shaft, install the key. Install this bracket. Slide your pulley back on, lining up the key on the pulley with the key on the shaft. Stick your washer and nut on. So now what you're going to do is rotate your torque converter to where you need it and tighten it down. Now what you're going to do, take your collar and slide it onto your shaft. The first half of your pulley, slide it onto your shaft. Your brass collar. Then you're going to take your belt and install it. Then you're going to take this piece, make sure the two slits are facing out, and install it onto your shaft. Then you're going to take your other half of your pulley and slide it onto the shaft. And then you're going to tighten it down with your bolt. When you're tightening this, you're gonna to need to slide your flathead screwdriver into the slit and tighten it down. And 
And there you go. Your torque converter is installed onto your engine. Thank you everyone for watching. If this video helped you out, please consider liking and subscribing. And I'll see you in the next video.